I have a OnePlus 8T here. I'm going to show you how to transfer files such as photos and videos directly from your AT to your MacBook or Apple computer using a cable here. Now the first thing I want to note is with the AT, the OnePlus AT, you get a, uh, a charging cable here, data sync cable. It's a USB-C to a USB-C, okay? The thing is, I don't have a USB-C or basically a Thunderbolt, Thunderbolt 3 port on this MacBook, so my only option is to go ahead and use a USB-A to a USB-C, okay? So the USB-A, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this into my MacBook here. And then another thing I know before I plug in my uh, AT here is in order for it to like recognize, you know, when, when you're on a uh, Windows computer and you plug it in, it finds it right away. However, on a, on a MacBook, it's a little bit different, but the easiest way to transfer files from your OnePlus to your MacBook all the time is first to download this Android file transfer. This is here what the icon looks like. I'll put a link below where you can download and install this. Once you install this, this will, little icon will be down here. And now every time you connect your OnePlus, it's automatically going to be, it's going to find it automatically and you're going to be able to transfer um, your photos and videos and other files as well. So let me go ahead and connect this right now. And now let me go ahead and let me, let me log in. Now the next thing I got to do is I have to go ahead and scroll down to notifications, scroll down. And then if you see right here, if you look right here, it says, uh, under other notifications is Android system, charging this device via USB. So go ahead and tap down on there, and then you also wanna tap on, tap for more options, tap on that. Now you can see by default, it's uh, selected no data transfer. You have to go up here where it says file transfer. So tap on that, and then right away, this right here pops up, it recognizes something. Let me just click on okay. All I gotta do to bring that window back up, let me go down back down here to the Android guy, or the uh, Android trans file transfer icon. Let me click on that, and now here we go. So from this window right here, all your photos and videos should be under the folder called DCIM. So we're gonna go ahead and double click on this, and then double click on the camera folder. And I only have a few photos and videos here, okay? Photos, you can see it's a JPEG uh, extension, and the video is MP4 extension. So from here, I can do whatever I want. I can go ahead and make a new folder. I can go ahead and drag and drop this photo, photo right onto my desktop right here as you can see or what I typically do is just I just make a new folder and I'll just call this like 8, 8T and then I'll go ahead and select whatever one files that I want so let's just let's just do the whole shebang I'll highlight all of these and I'll drag and drop this to my new folder on the desktop called 8T give it one second let it transfer it's all done now I'm going to double click on the 8T folder now this is on my MacBook's hard drive okay so I can always I can go ahead and disconnect now and there you go. Now I can bring some of these uh, videos into my um, video editing program and edit it from there. So pretty simple. Any questions, issues, comment below. Good luck.